Welcome to our next course on ICH GCP A6 Revision 2 and Revision 3 Updates, Implementing Risk Management Approaches for Compliance. Our learning objectives for the course are to discuss risk evaluation methodology, distinguish between the concepts of risk mitigation and risk acceptance, understand the concept of predefined tolerance limits, and describe centralized monitoring, and talk about best practice implementation based on practical experience. In addition to this course video, the course contains references and resources for you to access. Feel free to start and stop the video to access them as we move through the course, or you can review and download them after you watch the video. At the end of the course, and after you fully complete the video, you will have the opportunity to take a post-assessment. The post-assessment requires an 80% passing score to receive your certificate. And you have as many attempts as needed to achieve a passing score. So let's get started. So let's talk a little about the background, how we got here, and why this is applicable to what we do. So what is actually risk? It is the effect of uncertainty and objectives. Per ISO, that's the International Standards of Organ on Organizations, 31,000 objectives, its protocol, business, and organization are influenced by internal and external factors, which create uncertainty in achieving those objectives. The effect of this uncertainty is risk to the organization's objectives. So the concept here, one of the things we're really gonna be talking about are the three pillars of how we identify risk, probability, impact, and detectability. 